A. Listen, point, and say. One. Under. Two. Behind. Three. Next to. Four. Between. Five. In front of. Six. In. Seven. On. B. One. Listen and read. Tom and Alfie tidy up the classroom. Oh no! Okay, Alfie. Let's put the box next to the cupboard, please. Okay, Tom. Put the fan between the window and the cupboard, please. Where? Between the window and the cupboard. <sighs> Alfie, put the chair behind the desk, please. Okay, Tom. Oh, and put the backpack under the desk, please. Sure. And Tom. Where do I put the mouse? What? A mouse? Ah! B, two, listen and number. Look at the pictures. Listen. There is one example. One. Okay, Alfie. Let's put the box next to the cupboard, please. Okay, Tom. Can you see number one? This is an example. Now listen and number two. Put the fan between the window and the cupboard, please. Where? Between the window and the cupboard. Three. Alfie, put the chair behind the desk, please. Okay, Tom. Four. Oh, and put the backpack under the desk, please. Sure. And Tom, where do I put the mouse? What? A mouse? Ah! Yeah! B. 3. Practice the structure. Put the box next to the cupboard, please. Put the backpack under the desk, please. C. Listen. Sing along. Put the box next to the cupboard. Put the box next to the cupboard. Put the backpack under the desk. Put the backpack under the desk. Put the fan behind the chair. Put the fan behind the chair. Put the mouse between the box and the fan. Put the mouse between the box and the fan. Put the backpack in front of the table. Put the backpack in front of the table. Pronunciation tip. In natural English, in front of the sounds like in front of the. Listen. Put the box in front of the cupboard. 
box in front of the cupboard. Put the box in front of the cupboard. Now listen again and say. In front of the cupboard. Put the box in front of the cupboard. Put the box in front of the cupboard. D. Listen and draw lines. Two. Put the pencil in front of the book, please. Okay. Three. Put the crayon under the chair, please. Okay. Four. Put the pencil case between the cupboard and the window, please. Okay. Five. Put the eraser behind the desk, please. Okay. A. Listen, point, and say. One, math. Two, English. Three, music. Four, physical education. P. E. Five, Vietnamese. Six, art. B. One. Listen and read. The children are talking about their favorite subjects. Do you like school, Tom? Yes, Sophie. I love school. What's your favorite subject? I like art. And what's your favorite subject, Nick? Hmm. I like English. What about you, Mai? What's your favorite subject? I like math. Alfie, what's your favorite subject on Alpha? I like PE. It's great. B. Two. Listen and circle. Two. And what's your favorite subject, Nick? Hmm, I like English. Three. What about you, Mai? What's your favorite subject? I like math. Four. Alfie, what's your favorite subject on Alpha? I like PE. It's great. B. 3. Practice the structure. What's your favorite subject? I like math. C. Listen. Sing along. What's your favorite subject? What's your favorite subject? I like math. I like math. What's your favorite subject? What's favorite subject? I like English. I like English. What's your favorite subject? What's your favorite subject? I like music. I like music. What's your favorite subject? What's your favorite subject? I like P.E. I like P.E. What's your favorite subject? What's your favorite subject? I like Vietnamese. I like Vietnamese. What's your favorite subject? What's your favorite subject? I like art. I like art. B. 3. Practice the structure. What's your favorite subject? I like math. Pronunciation tip. In natural English, 
What's your sounds like what's your listen? What's your favorite subject? What's your favorite subject? What's your favorite subject? Now listen again and say. What's your favorite subject? What's your favorite subject? What's your favorite subject? D. Listen and draw lines. Two. What's your favorite subject, Bill? I like P.E. Three. What's your favorite subject, Ben? I like English. Four. What's your favorite subject, Joe? I like Vietnamese. Five. What's your favorite subject, Cody? I like music. Six. What's your favorite subject, Tom? I like art. A. Listen, point, and say. One, Monday. Two, Tuesday. Three, Wednesday. Four, Thursday. Five, Friday. Six, Saturday. Seven, Sunday. B, one, listen and read. The children are talking about their school timetables. When do you have PE, Lucy? I have PE on Tuesday. When do you have math, Tom? I have math on Thursday. When do you have art, Lucy? I have art on Wednesday. When do you have music, Tom? I have music on Friday. I love music. A B C D E F G. Ugh! Stop it! B, two, listen and circle. Two. When do you have math, Tom? I have math on Thursday. Three. When do you have art, Lucy? I have art on Wednesday. Four. When do you have music, Tom? I have music on Friday. I love music. A B C D E F G. Ugh, stop it. B three. Practice the structure. When do you have math? I have math on Monday. C. Listen. Sing along. When do you have math? When do you have math? I have math on Monday. I have math on Monday. When do you have English? When do you have English? I have English on Tuesday. I have English on Tuesday. When do you have music? When do you have music? I have music on Wednesday. I have music on Wednesday. When do you have PE? When do you have PE? I have PE on Thursday. I have PE on Thursday. When do you have Vietnamese? When do you have Vietnamese? I have Vietnamese on Friday. I have Vietnamese on Friday. When do you have art? When do you have art? I have art on Saturday. I have art on Saturday. When do you go to the park? When do you go to the park? I go to the park on Sunday. I go to the park on Sunday. 
Pronunciation tip. In natural English, when do you sounds like Wendia. Listen. When do you have English? When do you have English? When do you have English? Now listen again and say. When do you have English? When do you have English? When do you have English? D. Listen and draw lines. Two. When do you have math? I have math on Wednesdays. Three. When do you have Vietnamese? I have Vietnamese on Friday. Four. When do you have art? I have art on Thursday. Five. When do you have music? I have music on Tuesday. Six. When do you have English? Oh, I have English on Thursday. A. Listen, point, and say. One. Draw pictures. Two. Read books. Three. Spell words. Four. Take tests. Five. Listen to music. Six. Do exercise. B. One. Listen and read. Alfie is asking the children about school. Hi, Alfie. It's time for English. What do you do in English? I spell words. How am I? Hi, Alfie. I'm going to PE class. Cool. What do you do in PE? I do exercise. Hey Nick, what do you do in music? I listen to music. Hi Alfie, I'm going to art class. What do you do in art? I draw pictures. Oh great! Can you draw a picture of my new friend? B. Two. Listen and put a tick or a cross in the box. Two. Hello, Mai. Hi, Alfie. I'm going to PE class. Cool. What do you do in PE? I do exercise. Three. Hey, Nick. What do you do in music? I listen to music. Four. Hi, Alfie. I'm going to art class. What do you do in art? I draw pictures. Oh, great! Can you draw a picture of my new friend? <coughs> B. Three. Practice the structure. What do you do in English? I spell words. C. Listen. Sing along. What do you do in art? What do you do in art? I draw pictures. I draw pictures. What do you do in Vietnamese? What do you do in Vietnamese? I read books. I read books. What do you do in English? What do you do in English? I spell words. I spell words. What do you do in math? What do you do in math? I take tests. 
I take tests. What do you do in music? What do you do in music? I listen to music. I listen to music. What do you do in PE? What do you do in PE? I do exercise. I do exercise. Pronunciation tip. Listen. I take tests in math. D. Listen and tick the box. Practice. Point, ask, and answer. Two. What do you do in art? I draw pictures. Three. What do you do in English? I spell words. Four. What do you do in Vietnamese? I read books. Five. What do you do in music? I listen to music. New words. Listen, point, and say. One, give a gift. Two, buy flowers. Three, make a card. Four, sing a song. Five, buy a cake. Listening, listen and number. The children are talking about Teacher's Day. Look at the pictures. Listen. There is one example. One. Ben, what's Teacher's Day? We say thank you to our teachers on Teacher's Day. So, what do you want to do for Teacher's Day? Hmm, I want to give a gift. Can you see number one? This is an example. Now listen and number. Two. I want to buy flowers for the teacher. Three. What about you, Kim? What do you want to do for Teacher's Day? I know. I want to make a card. Wow! Great, Kim. Four. Yes, good idea, Kim. And I want to buy a cake too. Yummy. The next day in the classroom. Happy, Happy Teachers, Teachers Day. New word. Listening. Listen and number. The children are talking about Teacher's Day. Look at the pictures. Listen. There is one example. One. Ben, what's Teacher's Day? We say thank you to our teachers on Teacher's Day. So, what do you want to do for Teacher's Day? Hmm, I want to give a gift. Can you see number one? This is an example. Now listen and number. Two. I want to buy flowers for the teacher. Three. What about you, Kim? What do you want to do for Teacher's Day? Yeah. Useful language. What do you want to do for Teacher's Day? I want to give a gift. Listening. Listen and write. 
Look at the school timetable. Listen. There is one example. When do you have PE, Lucy? I have PE on Monday. Can you see the word? This is an example. Now listen and write. One. And when do you have art? I have art on Wednesday. Two. When do you have music? I have music on Friday. Three. Tom, when do you have English? I have English on Tuesday. Four. When do you have Vietnamese? I have Vietnamese on Friday. Now listen again. C. Listen. Sing along. School, school, school. Study and play. School, school, school. We learn so much each day. When do you have English? English on Tuesday. I read books and spell words, and I'm happy to say I like English. School, school, school. Study and play. School, school, school. We learn so much each day. School, school, school. We learn so much each day.